What's going on guys, I'm back with another video and this video I'll be talking about one of the craziest pieces of news I've probably ever talked about on this channel. You know, I've talked about some crazy news in the past. I've talked about college boards, $500 million AP lawsuit, I've talked about the STV being cancelled, I've talked about a lot of things. But this one, you know, takes the cream of the crop, right? I think that's what you say, cream of the crop. I never really understood that saying. But before this video goes any further, guys, I want you guys to hit that like button, subscribe, join me on this journey. Let's hit 100K. Right? Let's hit 100K tomorrow. I know that's probably impossible, but if that happens, then think about it. I can say, hey, guess what? I predicted I would increase 80,000 subscribers in one day. Bang. So in all seriousness, guys, by now, by the time this video is released, it's either releasing on August 17th or August 18th, you know whether your test center will be holding the August SAT or not. And I know a lot of you guys are probably either crying or really happy. You're crying if your August SAT is canceled come this August 29th. You guys are probably really happy if your August SAT is not canceled come August 29th. Regardless, guys, just remember, SAT is test optional, so you don't have to, you know, it's not the end of the world if your SAT test center is canceled. You can just not take the SAT. But if you want to give your application that extra oomph, then just take the September SAT and just study more. Like, if anything, you have more time to study. So, you, so if you're getting a 1300, you can get a 1600 now. You never know. But that's not what this video is about, guys. So you guys saw the title of this video, the August SAT being lead, question mark, exclamation mark. So for reference, if you guys do not know, I'm sure many of you guys don't, but two years ago in August 2018, there was a lot of news regarding the SAT because apparently the August 2018 SAT was leaked. And a lot of news articles, you know, talked about this topic. They talked about what is College Board doing. It's supposed to have, you know, advanced security features. How can this possibly happen? College Board came out and said, what are you guys talking about? This is a rumor, right? Like we make sure our tests are 100% confidential. No one can access it because they want to make sure every student has a fair chance of getting that 1600. Every student has a fair chance when taking the SAT and then no student has an unfair advantage because they had access to the questions beforehand. College Board is making sure that never ever happens. And in August 2018, apparently, you know, some students said that, hey, he got the answers and he actually leaked the test and a lot of students were saying it was the same test. But, you know, there was no confirmation on this, right? It was, this was never confirmed. It's still most likely a rumor. Because you guys have to understand, College Board is a multi-billion dollar non-profit company. So with that much money, all right, with that much money, don't you think they'll have the best security ever? College Board has been administering SAT tests, AP tests, AC tests for years, for decades. So you should know that College Board is going to make sure that the test is very safe and secure from prying eyes or people who are trying to, you know, get hold of the SAT beforehand just so they can have that unfair advantage and give themselves that 1600 and basically cheat their way to the top. Because that's something you do not want to do, guys. Because if you are caught, you will be in for it. Like you can face legal charges, you can face monetary charges, you can face a lot of charges, and you can be banned from the SAT, uh, banned from whatever college you're going to. Because if a college finds out that you stole the SAT beforehand and you took the SAT you know, with some unfair advantage, yeah, you're getting kicked out of that college, bud. But now, why am I even saying that there's a possibility that August 2020 SAT got leaked? Well, I got this email the other day, and as you guys can see, this student was very, very worried, and he was very, very anxious about the August SAT, because he thought in his brain, hey, if students had the August SAT, you know, beforehand, and College Board, you know, gets the wind of this, they're going to invalidate the entire SAT. They're going to just cancel the August SAT altogether, no matter if your test center is open or closed. And I'm sure many other students are also worried about this, whoever heard this rumor. So I investigated, right? You know, as a uh, as your SAT guru, whatever, I investigated and actually sent an email to the email that the guy included or sent me via email saying, hey, you know, if you email these people, pay them this much money, you get the SAT. And apparently, guys, the SAT they were offering was not the August SAT. All right, and I knew that, because come on now, like I said, College Board, multi-billion dollars, they have state-of-the-art security. There's no way anyone is getting a hand on the August SAT. And the people who, you know, were holding this uh, free S and the people who were supposedly got the August SAT beforehand, they're from like a foreign uh, place and they were just, you know, trying to make a quick buck. All right, but it's fake. The August SAT they're offering was just an international practice exam that's been released by College Board for, you know, a long, long time. All right, College Board releases SAT tests for a reason. So you guys can practice and you guys can hone your craft and get the score you want. They never release a test that has yet to be administered to actual students. And the test that these people were giving you was just a scam. It wasn't the actual August SAT that's coming up. It was just an exam that's already been administered in the past that College Board wants you to look at. So if anything, they're helping College Board. They're saying, hey, College Board, you know, you release this exam so students can, you know, use it and practice. We're just going to give this exam to students and claim it's an August SAT when it's really not. So College Board's part, they're perfectly safe. Right, the August SAT has never been released. 
and it will not be released until exam day and everyone has a fair chance of taking this test. So do not get duped by these people and start paying the money to get this fake August SAT, guys. This is an SAT that's already online, all right? This isn't one of the 10 you see on Khan Academy on College Board's website. This is an international exam that you can find through some deep Google searching. You'll find it, right? you find it if you maybe go on the Prisoner Review site. I think it was Prep Scholar site, you'll find it. But it is not any SAT that any student will take in the future. It's only SAT that students have taken in the past. So stop worrying about this, alright? So all these spam emails you guys are getting regarding the August SAT being leaked, if your friend tells you, or if on Reddit you see that the August SAT is leaked, just don't trust it, alright? It's really fake and it's full of poop, alright? It's not, it's not true. So the final verdict, guys, is the August SAT is not leaked, alright? No student has an unfair advantage for this August SAT. So do not worry, do not think the August SAT will be canceled altogether by College Board. Do not think your studying will go to waste, it's not like that. So I hope you guys you know, have some clarity, I hope I clear any doubts that you guys may have. Please like the video guys, please share it, please subscribe. Like I said guys, join me on this journey, 100k you already know tomorrow. Thank you guys for watching, peace out dude, peace out dude. Oh, the left hand, usually I do the right hand, right? But I do the left hand today.